Hey guys, so I want to touch upon something. Uh, many people say, what can I do like with my technique to get better? What am I doing wrong? Many times, my friends, it's not your technique that's failing you. It's your minds that's failing you. Uh, sometimes when I train with my students, actually not sometimes, oftentimes, they'll almost have my guard passed and then in their mind, they believe they can't do it and then they'll pull back on the guard pass. They'll almost have me in a submission or a choke and they'll look at my face and I'll show zero emotion so they'll let go of the choke because in their minds, oh, I can't have it, I can't have it. When you can't have it, you can't have it, you do have it, you just have to believe. You know so much more than you realize, okay? Uh, and there's an irony in jiu-jitsu, right? Just react, don't think. But then people tell you, you have to think about what you're going to do. So what do you do? Do you react or do you think? Do you think or do you react? Which one is it? Where is it at? It's a little bit of both, right? So if somebody's passing your guard hard, you don't really have time to think. You have to react and recover guard, okay? That will come through practice. That will come through mat time. That reaction will come through a lot of practice. After the training session, you could think about how you recovered guard or how you didn't recover guard, all right? So there's always a time and a place to do something. You have to realize that. My advice to people when they struggle with confidence in jiu-jitsu is, listen, just relax. Just do the best you could. Stop comparing yourself to other people. Stop worrying about what your training partner is going to do. Stop worrying about what your opponent's going to do. You could only control one person. That's yourself. Focus on your own technique. Focus on getting better. Focus on doing the things that you're taught to do in class. Focus on action, reaction, reaction, action. Focus on just having fun, okay? So don't let your mind be a reason that you may be, you know, coming up short. Don't let your mind be a reason why you don't execute techniques. Because sometimes, again, like I said, it's not your techniques that are failing you. It's your mind that could be failing you, all right? So just don't practice making your techniques stronger. Practice making your mind stronger. All right, guys, have a good day. Happy Monday.